hey guys how's it going what's up everybody don't mind this crazy hair it's sticking up right there how's everybody doing um so in today's video i guess what we're gonna be playing with we're gonna be playing with the new ColourPop x lizzie mcguire palette so if you're interested in that then please stay tuned Okay, so like I said in today's video, we are going to be playing with the ColourPop X Lizzie McGuire collection. So I was going to buy the whole collection. It was $111, but I stopped myself because A, I don't have the money to spend $111 on that. And B, I knew I wasn't going to use everything. Like, the blushes were just too, like, pink for me, I think. I wasn't going to use those lip gloss things. Um, or the, what is it, a glitter um, eyeshadow or, like, glitter gel set. The Juicy Gloss Kit. Um, I wasn't going to use that stuff. And then, uh, yeah, is that it? Yeah. So I just spent the $22 on the palette. So here's what the packaging looks like. Oh my God, this is such nostalgia for me. I grew up watching this. It's fantastic. And Gordo, Gordo was my favorite. Um, so that's the packaging. And then this is the palette. It's called What Dreams Are Made Of. So this part is raised. And then the back, like the outlines are raised. Now I did think this palette, I don't know why, but I did think this palette was gonna be a little bit bigger. Like $22 for that tiny palette. It is 12 shades. So there they are. But I mean, it is Disney, Disney Lesbian Wire, so $22, yeah. So that is it. So I'm gonna go ahead and swatch it. What? So these are the shades. And there's my dog barking. And my husband downstairs. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and swatch these for you guys and then we'll be right back. Okay, so here are all the colors swatched. Oh my God, it's giving me such high school. <laughs> oh my God, this is fantastic. So I will show you, okay. I don't understand why ColourPop does this. Like this color is called Outfit Remember, but on the back it says bye bye, which is this color over here. So I'm so confused. So we are going, let's see if I can do it right. So this one, let's see. Okay, so this one, this like champagne color is bye bye. This one's puh bees. This one is done and done this one is outfit remember this green shimmer is dear diary this one is Audi. this one is Ugh. the purple shimmer is hello fabulous don't mind my busted nail i'm going to get them done this week this green is don't freak this one's really pretty. It's like a coral color. It is so mature. Outfit repeater. And this purple is digital bean. So there's all of them swatched. I think I want to put, I don't know what I want to play with. See, I don't know. What so there is one, two, three. There's only four mattes in this palette, which is this one, this one, this green, and this one. And then the rest are shimmers. I think I'm gonna play with uh and out oh, and so mature, I think, which are these two. I mean, that's like really the only ones I can play with. I don't know, we'll figure something out. So let me go prime my eyes and then we'll be right back. Okie dokie. Okay guys, we are back, the eyes are primed. And then let me find a brush. I think I'm gonna play with my Jaclyn Hill brushes today. That I just got. So I'm going to use this brush, which is the JH37. And I'm going to dip into, uh, which is this one right here. 
Uh, when I, that's what I meant to say, when I did swatch this color in the top, bye bye, the pan felt like it was going to fall out. So the pan is loose, so just FYI. Which that happened in another one of my ColourPop palettes. This hair is annoying me. Oh, I don't know if you guys noticed, or if you follow me on Instagram, then you already saw it. But your girl finally got a haircut. <laughs> it's all, like, now it almost, almost can all fit in frame. But it's so much shorter then it was literally I was literally like sitting on it every time I would sit down that's how long it freaking was now it just feels so much healthier and lighter oh my god it feels so much lighter so this color is laying out nicely there is some kick up in the pan which you all know it doesn't bother me I just let you guys know Really pretty color. I think this look is literally just gonna be like a simple look today because, yeah, maybe. I don't know. We'll see. I think I'm gonna do a different color, like on this side of my eye. Oh, let's see. I think I'm gonna take this green maybe let's see oh my ear just maybe i'll take this green and put it like right here so i'm gonna dip into don't freak which is this green color right here and we're just gonna see if i don't like it oh well it's just makeup we can take it off remember oh that's oh is she pretty oh yeah i think i'm gonna do that so now I gotta see if I can, uh... actually, you know, I'm just gonna leave this eye how it is and I'm gonna do this eye this way. We're not gonna mess with it. Then I'm just gonna take a little smaller brush, which is the JH52. And just kind of blend the edges ever so slightly. Okay, now I think I'm just going to go in with this coral color, which is ugh, so mature right here. And just pop it on the lid. Let's see. This isn't like, I mean, I guess that's not, I guess that's more of a shimmer. So then I'm going to take, which one is that? Or it's not like, I don't know. I don't know what you would consider that one. Let me see if it says. I'm going to take this. Uh, this one, Audi. And go on the lid over top of that. Because this one's more like a shimmer. That one's kind of just like. An eyeshadow mixed with glitter. <laughs> I don't know how to explain it. Maybe I'll use my finger. That's better. And then I think I'm going to use the green shimmer on this eye. I'm just going to mix it up a little bit. It's probably going to turn out like dookie, but. We'll see. It actually didn't turn out good. Surprisingly. Okay, and we're just gonna take some of that pink and kind of blend it in. Okay. So that's what we're working with. I'm not too happy with this eye, but it's okay. I kind of like this eye. But it's okay. So we're gonna go ahead and clean all this up. And I'm gonna do the rest of my face and this little hair is 
bugging me, but it's okay. And we will be right back. Okay, guys, we are back, and here's the finished look. So, my overall thoughts and opinions on the ColourPop X Lizzie McGuire What Dreams Are Made Of. So, the packaging, 100%. They hit that nail right on the head. It just screams Lizzie McGuire. Um, the colors, they're cute. Um, will I ever use this palette again? Probably not. Because it's just not my vibe. But... The colors that I used worked well. They blended out together. I mean, it's ColourPop. Come on. For the price point of ColourPop, ColourPop is freaking fantastic. Um, I am glad I did not buy the whole bundle for $111 because I probably would have been very disappointed. <laughs> Considering I wouldn't have used the blush, the jelly lip, lip things, or the um, glitter things. So I am glad I only spent the $22 on the palette. Um, and if you like it, go pick it up. If you don't, I'm not going to tell you to go get it. But it's cute. It's 90s, 2000s, whatever. It's cute. Um, so yeah. Um, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And ring that notification bell. So you do get notified every time I do upload a video. Um, thanks guys. See you in the next video.